Last night around 7 o'clock, New Haven police say a shot spotter alerted them of a shooting. And it turns out those shots were fired in front of the home of State Senator Gary Winfield. And as a result, a 33 year old man was injured. Fox 61's Tony Terzi joins us live from New Haven uh, from the police department there with more. Tony. Uh, State Senator Gary Winfield uh, heads up the Criminal Justice Committee in the state legislature in Hartford, ironically. And when police got to the home of Winfield, they saw the victim of the shooting on the front porch. Winfield confirmed that he went right outside after the shooting to check to make sure that the victim was okay. Two of the gunshots actually hit Winfield's residence. One of them went into the garage. Another struck an upstairs win window. And Winfield's children, according to police, were upstairs at that time, but thankfully nobody from the family was hit. A 33-year-old male victim hit by gunfire in the lower back. He's in stable condition. At this time, the, there was himself and someone else walking, and they believed they were being fired upon, and the only reason why the bullets went in the area center of Winfield's house is because they ran that direction. Police say that they got some good video of the scene, and it appears that the vehicle that was driving while firing shots from that vehicle fled and was headed toward Hamden. We asked police if they would reveal the make, model, um, color of the vehicle. They said at this time we're not going to do that. Assistant Chief Jacobson said the camera footage from the area and community assistance really helped in this case. And they said, really, that's been helping them with their solve rates of late. Camera footage and community support. And they say, you know, they're hoping to upgrade the shot spotter system very soon. And they expect to have 500 cameras online before too long. That was approved by the Board of Alders. Again, State Senator Gary Winfield's home struck by gunfire. None of his family members were hit, thankfully. Live in New Haven outside the PD, I'm Tony Terzi, Fox 61 News.